Sister wives suckers see that Christine Brown has moved on from Cody, her spiritual hubby of 27 times. Along the way, they produce six children, Michael T., Aspen, Gwenlyn, Isabel, Paydon, and Truly. At the moment, Gwen is discovering some tea, and suckers are shocked at her casually dropping jarring news about what her mama and paid her. Allegedly buried in their vicinity. If you like this video please don't forget to subscribe our channel and turn on the notification button. Cody Brown gets slammed by his son who has been participating her take on spoilers from season 17. Relatively frequently, at the end of her vlog, she does a can a session. Frequently her answers to questions are more intriguing than the rest of her vids. So far, TLC suckers heard that she formerly called her father a massive pessimist. Describing him, she also indicated to him as being useless and only concentrated on himself. Well, numerous sister wives suckers are thrilled that Christine ditched Cody Brown and moved back to Utah. Utah is a place that holds numerous recollections for her. Plus, the kitties are substantially there. And, she met David Woolley there as well. In fact, they came engaged and suckers will see that play out in a new season of the show. In the meantime, Gwen keeps folks interested in the family by discovering her tea. But people weren't awaiting the rearmost reveal. On Patreon, Gwen was busy delivering content to her suckers, and a clip ended up with Katie Joy of Without a Crystal Ball on Instagram. Katie reminded suckers that Janelle Brown and Christine had preliminarily mentioned that Cody's former third woman had a confinement. Katie wrote, according to Christine and Janelle's stories about this confinement it took place late in the gestation. Janelle allowed. Christine wouldn't have any other kitties because of it. Sister wives suckers were shocked to see in the clip that Katie participated, that Gwendon sounded completely ignorant of anything wrong in telling followers that her mama and paid her. Buried the aborted baby in the vicinity. Gwen said she flashed back this confinement because they piled up jewels to keep the tykes out. Katie also wrote. Then is the evidence of Gwenlyn saying that her mama and paid her. Buried a fetus in the vicinity under jewels so the tykes do not eat the baby. Christine's son also recalls that the child was a boy. Commonly, sister wives Faz sounded a bit shocked. After all, it did not sound as if the child was still in the veritably early stages of development. Katie added, this was an alternate or third trimester confinement. It was veritably late because she nearly failed. It's not just about the fact that the baby misfired and was allegedly buried in the vicinity that shocked followers. One of them said, piecemeal from the egregious that's disturbing, she's so incurious about it all. Your family buried a baby in their vicinity. Another follower wrote, OMG I misfired at eight weeks and buried my baby in a casket in a legal cemetery. This is horrible. Poor Christine. I know this had to tear her ma's heart piecemeal. I go we can guess who made this decision to save plutocrat sick, sick, sick. However, he was well formed, if you could see the baby's coitus. He deserves to be recaptured and given a proper burial. What are your studies? Do you suppose that it seems shocking to bury a baby in the vicinity? If you like this video please don't forget to subscribe our channel and turn on the notification button.